Today we're checking out AI music from Mason Star. Stick around if you want to know more. So to get straight into it, what we need to do to check out this app is download Sounds Good on your Asus or NAS. Now if you want to do that, just go to the App Central, go to All Apps and search for Sound and it's just right there. In the interest of not boring you, we've speed, sped up the video a little bit, so if things bounce around a lot or whatever, then uh, please forgive us. Now there's a really nice UI, it's made by Asus Tor, so you can see that there's a local output for the HDMI, also for the media sources. Um, it only does uh, the music folder by default, so if you've got any music anywhere else on the NAS, you'll need to add this um, you know, after the fact, but it's very nice. Um, and also, a cool thing about uh, this program as well is you can add permissions, so uh, change things like local inputs, tagging, and uh, local output, sorry, and the default collection, which I'm going to remove because my users don't need that. Now, the NAS, the actual uh, app, sorry, is very nice. It's got a search bar, collection bar. The main content is in the center. As you can see, you can drag and drop songs around the place, including into playlists. You have the main playback bar on the bottom with the standard features, and then the standard features like uh, sorting by album or artist, adding songs to playlists, or adding entire folders or artists to playlists. And then you also have the tile or uh, you know list view, um, which again is fairly uh, you know standard by now. Uh, and just uh, to point out on the top, as you can see, the play bar, uh, playback does work. This is hopefully outputting. Um, but uh, yes, the on the top wall, uh, top right there you can see what songs playing on the uh, just lower than that you can see the album art and then you can see the playlists on the bottom um, it does seem to have a little bit of a problem with recognizing the length of songs um, but this will be updated eventually as uh, Isitor definitely updates their apps regularly which is really really nice to see now moving on to my phone screen which I managed to get recording via Blackmagic and Wizardry you have to enable the uh, uh, basically connect to the NAS uh, I use Auto Discovery which is really easy all you need to do is put your name and password after you hit Auto Discover on your network you can use Cloud ID if you're not connected uh, in the same local area network um, but the app is very nice looking, has a very nice uh, UI and is very easy to use as well. So as you can see, uh, when you play a song, um, such as if you hit the random play button, uh, you can see there is a top, uh, a uh, sort of uh, widget in the uh, drag down bar at the top. But you can hit random songs and it will just literally play a playlist of random songs. You can search by artist, you can search by album, just like the, uh, the online interface itself. Um, it's a fairly nice UI actually, it's quite nice because you can search through folders as well, you can change the volume obviously, you can add songs to playlists on the, the uh, phone as well as on the uh, NAS itself which is really nice uh, and just overall it's a fairly nice app to use, it doesn't seem to have too many problems, it has party mode which is nice as well so you can just hit a random playlist for you know if you're having a party and you can stream to perhaps your Rocky if it ever worked on my phone um, and uh, yeah it's, it's pretty nice so the taskbar icon uh, works pretty well haven't had any issues with it. You can also download the songs from the NAS to the uh, the phone itself, which is really, really nice. Um, so that's pretty much it. If you want to know more about this app, then definitely let us know in the comments down below. Do you have an Asus Tor NAS, and would you use this feature? Uh, let us know in the comments down below. Otherwise, do all the likey like and subscribe your stuff, and we'll see you later. So thanks for watching this Tech Team GB video. You've probably seen enough of me already, so I'm going to go away. Right after I say, if you haven't already liked or disliked, just let us know why in the comments down below as well. Um, check out some of our other videos, hopefully there'll be some somewhere around me. And then also, um, feel free to subscribe as well, that really helps us out. Um, and yeah, obviously shows companies that you love us. So if you do love us, check us out on Facebook or Twitter, hopefully there will also be some stuff around here maybe. Um, but otherwise that's pretty much it from me, so we'll see you all in the next video.